Today the church is so weak that uh, you who have known your pastor for years, somebody that uh, does not even know him, somebody that does not even come here, will come to inform you of inner things of your pastor that you know and you accept him. He's telling you, I want to tell you something about your pastor. You say, tell me. I told you, if you found such a person, you have found a witch. If, for instance, I have a challenge, what is your problem? But only a dog will go to somebody's dustbin and take what he has already thrown in the dustbin, bring it back in the open. Every time you go and dig somebody's dirt and bring it in the open, you know what you are? A D.O.G. If you will go to your brother's dirt, I'm investigating his dirt. It's like you wake up in the morning and see somebody in your dustbin is investigating what you've been eating. Ah, salami. Inkomazi. That person is a DOG. Are you hearing me? And the people who are spiritual say, every time you begin to dream with a DOG, you must know you are under a witchcraft attack. You know that? When you are attacked by dogs at night, they say it's witchcraft. Are you hearing me? I told you, when somebody is out there to destroy, especially your leadership, the reputation, you have found a witch. When somebody goes and digs your dirt, every house has a dustbin. You have things you are not proud of. That's why you have an area where you dump it. It's only a D.O.G. that goes back there to dig it out and bring it to your sitting room. The devil is a liar. A witch must die. Every attack, therefore, that my life had ever been exposed to, it may have come with many, many names. It has always been because of one thing. I, Aflokau, whip the devil. I say, I of Lukao, whip the devil. Every day, they have investigated and they say to him, Give God glory, for we know that man is a sinner. You see, the plan of the devil is always to discredit the source. And when he's discrediting the source, is discrediting the source because he wants you down. He wants you to vomit what God has fed you. The world does not want your miracle. They don't want your blessing. They want you to remain where you are. They want you to die in your sin. They want you to die in your pain. But the devil is a liar. Amen. I'm here to say the devil is a liar. God is about to do exceedingly, abundantly, above all that you ask and hope for. Hear me. I'm a man of miracles. Anybody under me. You will walk in power. Amen. You will walk in power. Amen. This is a house of miracles. My ministry is founded on the power of God. I am not just a sweet talker. No, I am a man of power. Now, I ask you a question. How many of you have received a blessing and a miracle and a testimony in Hallelujah Ministries? Wave to me. Look at this. Wave, wave. Your life has changed here. Wave. 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 Here. Yeah. Now. If somebody anointed to be a DOG comes to tell you, you see everything that's happening there is not God. That guy is a sinner. You have something to say. One thing I know. I was blind. And now I can see. When you know 
know what you are. You stop crying. Amen. There are times where I look at the devil. I say nothing. He gets the message. It doesn't move. He runs. <laughs> <laughs>